guys, here we are today for a new product. Today I'm going to show you the Linksys Velop. What this product does is giving you wireless if you have a huge house, for example, like mine. It's a lot of routers, access points, and I really, really hate it. To resolve all these issues, I have this product here. What this product does is it's got three nodes. Each node will communicate with each other and will give you the same wireless and password. This means that, uh, for example, if you have a really, really huge house, you can buy you can buy more nodes and apply them to the already wireless Wi-Fi that you have at your home. Before starting speaking about the product itself, I'm going to show you how the product is made. Okay, as you can see, we have here the box. Let's open the box and you see the three nodes and the manual. An Ethernet cable and uh, the three power supplies for each node. Okay, let's now take off one of the nodes and see how it works. All nodes are, are exactly the same and you've got internet for my house, you connect to the left side. If you want to give internet connection for a PlayStation, Xbox One, PC, plug here the internet cable and you put on a switch and you can do wherever you want. It's basically uh, out of the internet. In here, as you can see, you have the red button, it's the reset. You have to press it 10 seconds to reset the, these nodes. You have this, the AC connection for the power supply and the turn on and off of the node. As, as you can see, all the nodes are exactly the same. They have the same connections, they have the same bottoms. Everything is exactly the same. You don't need to connect this one first and the other one first, no. You connect just one and then you install the application that links is as in the Google Store, for example, and you configure step by step each node. I will not show you the step by step because basically you just download the app and you follow just each step and you will know you will not have any problems installing these nodes. So now what we're going to see is try them, see if they work. I'm going to try, for example, be in one floor and the other and check if there is connection or not. OK, let's try out. Two hours later. I tried the Linksys develop application. I had some issues configuring the initial process because I have too many switches and too many router, routers in my house. So I decided to pick up the, one of the nodes that connected directly to my house modem. After that, I just pick up the other two nodes, put them in the same space and made the configuration for all of the three. I prefer like this because it was really easy, I didn't have any lack of network, I didn't have any lag, so the connection was a straightforward connection, it was really easy. As you can see the node is connected to my principal router of the house, I pick up one of the routers that I had close to my my master nodes, I pick them and went go to the upstairs. So I have the careful of putting the node uh, in the first floor uh, in the same position as the ground floor. So to try to have the connection between them and have uh, wireless in my second floor. But uh, as you can see, I've tried many things. You see in the application that I was losing connection. I couldn't connect it, even detecting my wireless uh, velop. It couldn't connect it, I don't know why, so for uh, resolve this issue what I did was connect directly my LAN to the, to the nodes. That way the node start working as a point access and uh, as you can see now I'm testing the net speed. It was a really great speed for download and upload. Then what I did was went far away about uh, 16 feet away to the other room of the same floor and uh, the speed was totally crap. I mean, went from 100 megabytes to 8 megabytes, as you can see in the, the image. But I, can, I, I must say, you, but I must warn you guys that my house is made of bricks, really huge bricks. That's the reason why the wireless is not working really well. Because my, my house has a floor heated with, with water and for that reason, my uh, bricks are really, really high, so that makes the connection between wireless really, really bad. But if you are, uh, for example, installing a new house, you have a new house and uh, you want to expand your wireless, this is a really nice product because you just have to plug in the first node and expand all the nodes, which is really great to have wireless 
in all the house, the same wireless, the same SSID, the same password, it's fantastic. As you've seen in the beginning, I've used separated Wi-Fi for each floor, which is awful. So guys, this is my video for today, I hope you enjoyed, don't forget to thumbs up this video, follow me on Instagram and Twitter, subscribe to the channel, and as always, bye bye and see you soon!